Guess who it is? Too late, it's me. And let's see what do I have here? Gotta get over to the zone. All right, let's do the thing. Left, right, right, right. Seems good to me. Now, now you know the rest of the drill. Hang on, hold your Bonkos, whatever that means. Okay, we got dog. Specter pooch. Loading for many years. Oh, there it is. This is a deceptively pleasant title screen. Alright. New game, yeah. Auto saves. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> I'm just so excited to see the adventures of these people. It's the dog. Here we go. Here we go. 
If I'm not mistaken, that's her first appearance in one of these. So what do you guys think about the volume balance? Could the game stand to maybe be a touch louder? Yeah, I think maybe it could be. Just a touch. Okay, and I'll I'll trust that. So let me switch over. know the drill switching over to the to the good the good audio Dang, these, these computer chair wheels are like the worst thing. Gotta adjust those a little bit, I think. Oh, okay. Okay, so let's see what's going on. Yo, Mario. Oh, okay, well, actually, I have, I have skipped the second game because I am unable to stream it in any way. So here's a quick recap of the events of the second game if you don't know what they are. Uh, if you don't want to be spoiled, I guess mute it a little bit for a little bit. Or if you're watching on YouTube, just skip ahead a while. I guess once Luigi stops doing this, I'd give you an exact time and in the annotations, but we don't have those anymore. Anyway, so basically, in the second game, there's this place called the Evershade Valley. There's this artifact called the Dark Moon that pacifies the ghosts. Egad's like, holy cow, that sounds awesome. I'm going to go there and research. So he does. Somebody breaks the Dark Moon, and the ghosts are no longer pacified. So basically, uh, he sends the first man he can think of to go after the ghost. Unfortunately, he's busy, so he has to settle for Luigi. After which, Luigi, you know, goes through the mansions and stuff, and it turns out, surprise, surprise, King Boo's behind it. He's the one who broke it. He's not happy that he was put in a painting. Luigi puts him in a painting again, because let's face it, they're not gonna kill Luigi. And that's about the plot of the second game. Oh, and Luigi adopts a ghost dog. All right, got some physics. Oh. 
So I'm noticing right off the bat there's a strafe button. X seems to be the button you use to check stuff. Welcome to the last resort, home of the most memorable vacations ever had. Oh, all work and no play makes Jack a dull boy. Huh? <laughs> I like that Luigi can just walk right through Polterpup. So Y and A don't do anything yet. I mean, Luigi doesn't have his gear, so I guess I'm not surprised. Something the matter? I hope nothing is making your stay here less than perfect. Our entire staff is devoted to providing you with the ideal vacation experience. <laughs> yeah, you're 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 not at all suspicious. I trust you with my life. Is there a run button? If there is, there doesn't seem to be yet. So let's talk to the totally unsuspicious. You know, concierge that well I'll talk to Peach first. Hi. This hotel is so big, Luigi. It's gorgeously decorated too. We're so lucky to have gotten an invitation to come here. <laughs> Bye. Told. <laughs> Princess Peach definitely didn't forget to pack anything. Hey Luigi, what's up? Ah, oh no. Welcome, guest, to the last resort. Are you ready to check in? Yeah. Not a problem at all. Make yourself comfortable. Please come see me when you're ready. Are you ready to check in? Why is, why is no the default? Thank you. I thought I was on you. Yes, welcome to the last resort. My name is Helen Gravely, and I am the owner of this hotel. I am absolutely delighted that you decided to accept my invitation. Oh yeah, already I'm feeling more character from this than Dark Moon had. You all must be very tired. Come, allow me to show you to your room. Oh, no need to worry about your luggage. Our exceptional staff will take care of it for you. And might I add, extremely unsuspicious. Like, look at that guy. How could you be suspicious of that guy? <laughs> You're our VIPs, after all. We prepared a first-rate experience for you. All the trappings of luxury. Shall we get going? Are we going up to the 666th floor? No, just floor five. Oh, it should have been floor four because that one's the bad one. Mario, Luigi, and Peach's rooms are over here. We prepared rooms for you toads as well. I hope you enjoy your say. I dare say you'll remember it for the rest of your lives. <laughs> An equally unsuspicious thing to say, I must add. I mean, I guess the benefit of having a ghost dog is you don't need to get a doggy door. Very oddly shaped light. I mean, not light, a, a lock. So, what we got here? Got tea. Oh, and yeah, like I said. You know, I was talking about this during the original Luigi's Mansion. They made sidestep mode into a button. Good for them. Oh, I didn't mean to go in the bathroom. Luigi's heater. Luigi's toilet that he could honestly fit his entire head into. Not that I'd advise that. Oh, <laughs> 
Oh. <laughs> well, it's a spooky hand, but it's at least given me the thumbs up. Many things spook the weege. Woof, time to rest. Yeah. yeah. Ah. We have labeled luggage, embroidered even. You know, it's pretty bright out to be going to bed. Then again, this is Luigi. I like that this is not only a funny gag, but we have established in the canon, like this is a canon trait of Luigi now, that he just falls asleep like, like that. I mean, I know Dark Moon had a run button, so it seems weird that this one seemingly doesn't. Oh, now it's a spooky. Oh, oh, and we got old style Luigi's Mansion rules pointing with the C stick, the right analog stick, I guess. I guess, do, do they call it a C stick anymore? I don't think they do. Oh, there's a rat. Rat. Where's my dog? Where's my ghost dog? Well, I mean, probably where's Peach more so than anything, but also my ghost dog. Oh. Yep. You know, I heard about this in the reviews. The the glowing the glowing like wave of destruction. Yep, people mentioned this. I did hear about this. Gargoyles, always a good sign. Won't go to a hotel unless it's got gargoyles. Let's check on Mario. Oh, he's Oh my god. He did it. Boys, he said it. Yeah, I'm surprised at how unspoiled I am on this game. Guess I'll take that as a blessing. <laughs> Mario is eating pizza. And if this is to be believed, quite a lot of pizza. I mean, to be fair, Miles, spiders and spooky things go together like spiders and spooky things, which is to say very well. I'd be more shocked if there wasn't a spider somewhere. And yep, Peach is not here. As expected. Let's just rummage through her things like a total creep. On second thought, maybe let's not. not good. Alright. Well, if I see two little girls in the end of the hall, I'm backing up. Oh, she's dead. What a twist. Well, well, well. If it isn't my most esteemed VIP, I was just on my way to see you. Is your room living up to your expectations? Doesn't it scream good taste? 
Oh, I can barely contain myself. You have no idea how much I wanted you to accept my invitation. Why is that? I'm sure you're wondering. <laughs> you see? There's someone I truly adore. He's the inspiration for some of my greatest ideas, like inviting you here. I'm such a huge fan of his. That's so wonderful. That's why it's so wonderful that I get to introduce him to you. That's right, Luigi. I hope you're ready. Oh, I didn't expect them to pull out King Boo right this early. <laughs> Surprise, Luigi. It's me, King Boo. That old coot had me locked up tight in his lab. But guess what? I got out. The hotel owner over here was just dying to meet me. So she busted me out. Pretty lucky, huh? Anyway, I didn't think you'd actually show up here. I was ready, though, just in case. In fact, my vengeance is nearly complete. What do I mean by vengeance? Glad you asked. I'm trapping you and everyone in your little vacation party in frames. Ah, oh, there, there, Luigi. It'll all be over soon. It's time for a family reunion. Booyah! Oh, no! Mwahaha! <laughs> Take that! Oh, and there's one more frame, of course. I saved it especially for you. Stay right there and put on your best terrified face, Luigi. This is game over. Oh, and I think this is pretty much a callback to the final boss of Dark Moon, honestly. And I'm gonna take a wild guess that E. Gad is staying in one of the rooms. Oh no! Just do it! I gotta say, though, this intro is very promising. I, I like it. It's got character. It's got a little bit of darkness. I, I do I do appreciate this opening. Oh, luckily my dog's all right. Uh-oh, <laughs> You know Eek Ad's gonna be down here. Come on, Eek Ad, I know you're in this game. You can't hide from me forever. Ooh, some gold. Ooh, some bubble. Thank you. You know what they say, cleanliness is next to richliness. Also, the sink is now spewing <gasps> ectoplasm. <laughs> oh, the way Luigi looked at that was so great. Oh, oh I love it. How do I get you? I want whatever you are. Well, I guess we follow the dog. Come on, doggy. Quit playing around. Alright, well, what's in here? Oh, it's the parking garage. Oh, another rat. Oh, it's the car from the second game. Wow. 
At least if I'm not mistaken, that's what this is. That's a song from the second game, by the way. Yeah, I got the vacuum powers. Oh, that's a new, that's the new one. Woof, comfortable with what you've learned? Yeah. Thank you for teaching me quickly, dog. All right, see you later. All right, now we can do, finally, what we were meant to do. We can clean the universe. And this is suspicious. But I suppose not enough to act on. So, I hear something when I press Y, but nothing seems to happen. And we got the we got the stro bulb. Okay, you can also stro bulb with R. All right, hello, Langton. Nah, rotate over here. Ooh, yes. Give me whatever that is. Okay, rat sucked. This is, uh, not inverted axis, and it kind of bothers me. Because Luigi's Mansion 1 was inverted axis. Oh yeah, I learned about the strafe, don't worry. Oh, but it's inverted when you're in vacuum mode. So in vacuum mode, strafe is default, but you can hold B to turn. Which is good to know. You know, just get to my bearings here. Learn how everything works. Can I can I swirl this around to get treasures? Doesn't seem like it. But there is junk pile. I'm the trash man. Sorry if my commentary is a bit quiet right now, but I'm just kind of enamored with this, honestly. So far, it, it does seem very promising. I do like the way it's starting out. There is definitely an air of unease to this opening. And I will give it credit for that one. Okay, that's not good. <laughs> that does not work. Okay, so I can probably not get in here right now. This doesn't look like somewhere I can get into. So, first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go back here so I can get some of the money that's, that's in there.
There was like some money hiding around. Yeah, like that. Give me that. Please. Though I must say, it is kind of weird to not be playing this with like 3D effects and stuff. Luigi's turning is a little stiff when he's in vacuum mode. Okay, it doesn't look like I'm able to do anything with that, even with the vacuum. So I might have to come back. Okay, can check through this crack here. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, I mean, it, it's, it's alright, because this is a cartoon. But still, I did not expect the rat to get electrocuted. Not gonna lie, I almost thought it was going to get electrocuted and then turn into a ghost. Is that money? No, it's just towels, I think. Luckily, this is a vacuum of hyperspace. Able to contain all of what you want and what you need. I can turn this, though. Okay. <laughs> just... just who going mental, that fire extinguisher. You give me money. I don't want to get a rank D mansion again. D for dumb. That's the mansion I got. Okay, I could probably unplug something. Nope, not really. Ooh, yeah. The laundry room is where the money is, baby. All that cash that's falling out of people's pockets. Oh yeah, Luigi's gonna suck that right up. Got like one thousand twenty-one dollars just right out of the gate. Yeah, baby. Just to make sure. I mean, I can't unplug this, can I? Doesn't look like it. So yeah, I guess I'll just come back. So let's see, was there anything over this way? I didn't really look. Okay, I'm sure that... I, I honestly don't remember, but I'm sure if the dark light is in this game, that that's gonna be how I deal with that. Yeah, in case nobody knows, that's the Luigi's Mansion 2 thing. Like I said, since I'm not streaming it, and I know there's at least one person who's unfamiliar, I'll probably just point those things out when I see them. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, there's another fire extinguisher. Can I do anything with that? Oh yeah, I don't know if I mentioned, but the hold A to to sh like blind them is is how it worked in the second game, and you had an option to use that in the 3DS version of the first game. Like it gave you the ability to make uh, it play more like Luigi's Mansion 2, if that's your, you know, if that's your bag. Cause I won't lie to you, some parts of the first game were a little awkward. <laughs> I like that the dog's basically saying, no, no, go this way. Oh yeah, I unlocked this door that leads to God knows what. Okay, a vending machine. Give me some, uh... Wow. Uh -huh. Okay, money. I'll take money. I was hoping for a chocolate bar. Oh, I think there are some snacks in there. Never mind. Never mind. I guess I'm the idiot. 
I thought they were the idiots, but alas, it was me. Okay, there's... Coin painting. Oh, unless you can't tell, I can also move this by moving the controller around. You could probably tell. Ooh. Underneath. The underneath zone. Well, I mean, it was either being motion controlled or Nintendo programmed the weirdest camera in the history of the universe. Which, I mean, granted, I guess, suppose I would not put past them. Well, let's go up. Oh, litter. Oh, that was, that was Mike Jones' letter to Smash that I just vacuumed up. Can we, like, get this down? I need to get by. Luigi can't jump in this game. Do I just, do I just go back down? What do I do? Hang on, I got this. I got this. No. Wow. Oh. That's right, that's right. I gotta remember that is a tool at my disposal now. Because that's not a thing from the other two games. Oh, there's a... Uh, there's one of those gems. Don't know how to get there. Probably something I got to do with that spot. But I don't have that yet. Or this spot right here. Well, okay, it's not that. Yeah, it doesn't look like it right now. <laughs> just, God, just the whole couch. The whole couch. Well, I mean, it's accurate. This is usually where the money can be found. I mean, that's fireworks. Oh, oh I missed a dollar bill over there. Oh, no, wait, 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 wait. No, I didn't. I don't think. I mean, I guess there's a chance that maybe in the next Smash Brothers he'll have it. Maybe this game just entered development too late for that to be considered. Oh yeah, just vacuum up everything. That is the way I like to do things. Okay, you can go in there. That is something that can be done. Oh, that's right. He does, doesn't he? <laughs> it's these loathsome fools. So I'm not entirely sure how that operates so far. Yeah, no offense, fella. You are not as cool as the Luigi's Mansion 1 ghost.
granted, you are marginally better than the Dark Moon Ghost. Oh, but I can move him this way. I want to try and... Yes, a double! Got him. Well, let's let's just suck up the mail. This is my mail now. Oop, yep, just my mail. My my key. Okay, that doesn't work. Well, let's just suck up literally everything else before we do that. Yeah, I'm lucky that this vacuum has some kind of hyperspace technology so that I can just vacuum up entire books and not run out of space. But I mean, I guess that's EGAD for you. He knows how to do this stuff. Oh, <laughs> you just pick up the key with X. Yeah, get that mess out of here. I'm sorry, I just I just came off of playing the sec the second one. The first one. And in the first one, you would you absolutely would have had to vacuum up that key. You know I'm right. Hello, who is it? Dang old prank calls. Money. What inspired you to build a second last resort right next to the original? Oh, yeah, I actually meant to do that, but I forgot. Hang on, as soon as, as soon as I get done over here, I'll head back over there. Yeah. Curtains are gone. It's a beautiful night out, really. Just give me lots of things to vacuum. Yeah. Oh, gotta have the pumpkins. Gotta have the pumpkins. Break the pumpkins. That's the new Smash Brothers minigame. See, they couldn't do break the targets anymore. So this is what they're replacing it with. If only it was like Earthbound and there was smooth jazz in the box. Okay. So yes, I did see that, I just forgot about it. Okay, give me jewel. But not like jewel as in the kind you smoke or vape or whatever. I mean like a jewel. Wow, I'm even more rich than I was last time. God, it's just leaving money everywhere. Talk about irresponsible. Good news for me, though. What? I should probably try to speed this along a little bit. Let's check in here. Ooh, a jewel. Mouse has the jewel. Oh, there's a spider. Spider. 
you're playing it at the same time as Vine Sauce, no pressure. Well, I mean, I'll be honest, I never thought this that me playing this game was going to bring in the big numbers. I'm just doing it because it's fun. I mean, if you want the big numbers from me, wow. then, like... Weird, weird indie games and like fan games. That's that's my that's my thing. I I rolled up the carpet, but I don't think there's anything I can do with the carpet. Either way, we know that's there. We we'll just have to remember that. Check the other side real quick. Oh. A sign, my greatest weakness as Luigi. Probably, probably can do something with him. I mean, I was gonna say, like, don't spoil it, but I suppose suspicious thing is uh, able to do a thing later is not exactly the largest of spoilers. Like, I suppose that's not too big of a shock. And that's what I got the key for. Oh, sucked it right in. Luigi, my boy, I'm on the second floor. Isn't this a bit of deja vu? Oh, yep, there he is. Hang on, Egad. As soon as I get rich, I'll come over there and save you. He became what he set out to destroy. You were supposed to destroy the ghosts, not join them. Well, he's not a ghost, he's just a painting. Shoutouts to Luigi's Mansion for keeping Egad alive. As opposed to Toadsworth, who has not appeared since, like, 2008. Yeah, I know where this is going, don't worry. There's something over here. There's like rat noises. Is there money in here? Is there money in this plant? No, doesn't seem like it. Oh, very low, jazzy version. I like it. Okay, so, like, I could follow my dog. But what if I didn't? Like, what if I instead went over here? <laughs> well, can't go that way. For very well articulated reasons. Can go in here though. And get clothes. I don't exactly know how this game's progression entirely works. So I don't know if you're supposed to go here later or what. But I don't mind a little detour, especially if it gets me that gym. Oh, yeah. Yeah, buddy, 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 buddy. We eating gold-plated lasagna tonight. Oh, and there's a little bit of a puzzle. Yeah, give me whatever that is. Oh, it's a key. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ha. So 
So far, only complaint, Luigi is not humming the music. Oh, I had to go there, didn't I? Dang, Luigi. This time Luigi's back and he's mad. Let's just get those off of there. So, essentially what I'm gathering from this, Luigi is wanted and there's a reward. Spider. Spider, get... <laughs> okay. Gotta flash him to turn him into money. What's under here? Oh, it's the rats. It's the rats. It's the skull. Oh no, it's not a skull, it's a pig. That is considerably less terrifying. Yeah, I know dog. I know dog in... But can't you see that I'm trying to obtain riches? There's the dark light. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Oh. oh, I see that. I see that. I saw the gold spider. Don't think you can hide gold spiders from Dustin. Um Game's not chugging on my end. Is it is it still doing it? At least I didn't think it was. Tell me if it keeps doing it. Yeah, there's probably better capture cards that I could be having. Okay, so X activates that. And all you can also hold uh L and R, I think. A little weird. Yeah, I can see my dog's footprints. Oh, I just noticed it's not overheating. Like in the second game, there was a mechanic where you could only use it so much before it like overheated. And it looks like they took that out. Which, I mean, I'm not going to complain. It makes it easier to check for stuff. OK, 
Okay, but first let's uh, check the halls for Bowels of Holly. What's funny is that the poltergust would reheat in the prototype for the original game, but they took that out. So heat mechanics keep getting removed from these. I do appreciate that the game's tutorials are, are pretty brief and not too heavy-handed gives the player a chance to figure out things on their own. Because I know Nintendo has had an issue with that in the past. Oh. Oh, this is... You can tell this is the golden ghost... Catch the golden ghost and you get the mad money. The money ghost. Yeah, ghost money is the kind of money I got in my wallet right now. As in, I don't have any money! Oh. Didn't mean to do that, I wanted to use it here. Okay, was there anything interesting here? Sometimes you kind of got to play this game in a claw position with your hands. Alrighty, yeah, let's get you out of there. Oh, it's Egad and he's in HD. <laughs> the lips think. Ah, if it isn't Luigi, you're precisely the last person I'd expect to find here. Hold that thought, now isn't the time to catch up. What matters is, you'll do nicely. Come on, Luigi, get me out of here now. This hotel is filled to the brim with ghosts. Let's make a run for it. What was that? All of your friends have been captured. And you can't just abandon them here, you say? You're the same as ever, I see. Bit of a handful. Okay, I'm not thrilled about it, but I, Professor Elvin Gadd, have an idea. First things first, Luigi. We have to get to my car. Will you take me there? Hey, the new poltergust G-O-O -O you're wearing. You took that out of my car, right? We've got to get back to the underground garage. Let's go. All right, let's get the heck out of here. But not before I shine this dark light on everything. Oh, the D-pad. I didn't even think to try the D-pad. Hey, Luigi, take a look over there. The elevator will get us to the garage in an instant. Let's hurry before the ghosts find us. Oh, yes. Mama Mama Mario. Mama Mama Mario. Mama Mama Mario. Mama 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 Mario. Mama 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 Mario. I mean, the dedicated call out for Mario D pad isn't quite as catchy. Oh, that's right, that's right. Wow. Hey, Luigi, look at that. It's money and lots of it. Even with the dangers here, I'm sure we agree that money's still important. The ghosts don't seem interested in grabbing it. 
What's the saying? You can't take it with you? Well, I definitely want it anyway. Keep your eyes peeled and grab as much as you can, you know, while you're capturing ghosts and saving your friends. Multitasking. Alrighty, guy, yeah, let's get in here. Of all the... Someone has removed all the other elevator buttons. What's going on here? Hmm. A mystery for later, I suppose. Go ahead and give that B1 button a push. Didn't seem like any of your friends were trapped on 2F with me. <clears throat> they must have been taken to one of the floors higher up in the hotel. Which means, yeah, we're going to need those elevator buttons. Alright. This way, Johnny. Mm, what's the deal here? I thought that would be a dark light thing, but apparently not. I... <laughs> He gets kind of a jerk, <laughs> a little bit. Okay, well, at least we got the purple. Just checking. Oh, no, wait, the garage was this way, wasn't it? But I can still do that. I can still do this. Oh yes, a ghost bellhop, just like I said, just like I wanted. Oh, disguise is gone. No, no use for it anymore. Oh, I got hit. Okay, so you just want to, like, dodge when he's throwing it and do that, yeah. So I will admit, I'm not entirely certain when you do and do not want to use the slam mechanic. Oh yeah, thank you, I needed that. The button. Oh, those are definitely the elevator buttons. I never would have guessed a ghost had taken them. I can't imagine why you wouldn't have guessed that. I mean, I, that's the first place my mind would go. But there are only two. Maybe there are other ghosts out there with the rest of the buttons. No matter. Let's go to my car. I've got something very interesting that I want to show you. The animations in this game are really good. 
the Porta Lab. <laughs> Welcome to my lab. This is another of my brilliant inventions, a portable laboratory. It's sturdy, safe, and air-conditioned. I always knew I'd need this one day. Good thing I brought it along with me, right? Hmm, you want to know what I'm doing in this hotel? It's a bit of a long story, but in short, I was tricked. I got an invitation from someone claiming to own this hotel. They said they had a precious collection of ghosts scattered from all over the world. No self-respecting ghost researcher would pass up on such an appealing offer, obviously. I accepted their invitation, but when I arrived, the invitation was only a ruse. They captured me and took my precious ghost collection. <clears throat> that includes all the ghosts you'd worked so hard to catch for me before. Even King Boo. Losing him really got under my skin. He's my favorite. What? They've released King Boo? Ugh. That hotel owner, what has she done? Luigi, you're our only hope, against all odds, and without any hesitation, and at any cost. Get my ghost collection back. And speaking of ghost collections, why don't you give me all the ghosts you've captured so far? Well, I don't know, man. You, you, you've been pretty irresponsible with them. Alright, keep on catching those ghosts, and... Oh, and be sure to come back to the lab. I'll set up the gallery so you can view the ghosts you captured. Hmm? What's with that look, Luigi? Am I forgetting something important? Oh, oh! That's right, I forgot about saving your friends and family. Completely and totally forgot. <laughs> Regardless, to find ghosts in your friends, you'll need to explore this hotel. To help you out, I'll give you one of my greatest inventions yet. <laughs> I call it the Virtual Boo. VB for short. Oh, I love it. It's a state-of-the-art virtual reality device fitted with a fancy red screen. Really cutting-edge stuff, and red is all the rage, you know. Just wait until I finish the marketing materials on this. It'll fly off the shelves. <laughs> You can use the VB to communicate with me at any time. I appreciate the self-awareness here. Hey, maybe we can test out the communication system later. Press plus to look into the VB. It'll display your current objective for you, too. It's quite useful. Oh, and I have one more thing to give you. The very first thing you need to do is install this elevator tractor tracker inside the elevator for me, okay? Got it. Nice. As for what it is, I'll tell you later. Go on and get it installed. Head for the elevator. I'm counting on you, Luigi. Ah, so this is where we get our options. Explore hotel, map, title screen, multiplayer. Have to do that at some point. Oh, and there's a shop icon up there, but we can't access it yet. So I guess come back later. Oh yeah, I actually knew that the virtual boo was in it, but that doesn't make it not awesome. Oh uh, yeah. Okay, guide slash settings. Settings, guide, reconnect controller. Settings. Okay, so... I guess, like, I've heard that EGAD will kind of spoil a ton of puzzles for you. So I'm going to turn hints from EGAD off for now. So controls. R stick aim. Horizontal only, omnidirectional. Oh, so there's nothing to invert the axis. Movement while poltergusting. Don't turn, and I guess turn. And gyro sensitivity, I'll set that. I'll just set the two. Yeah, so I'll I'll leave hints from EGAD off. Also, I didn't know you could gyro control 
But yeah, you can gyro control the vacuum. I'll have to keep that in mind. Because that, that's pretty useful, I gotta say. Oh, and I got the plunger now. Didn't really... They didn't really tell me I had the plunger. Oh. No, I can gyro aim, I gotta remember. Gyro aiming feels a lot more natural for this. Because of the lack of inversion, as I mentioned. Yeah, unfortunately, people with spider phobia, be warned. This game's probably gonna have a few of those. Okay, so L or Y. So, yeah, X there. Yeah, this game's this game has a lot of uh, controls for you to get used to. Oh, you can climb that. Neat, neat. Oh, and there's a gym there. But how do I get that? I want that. Oh, maybe you can, uh... Oh, I think I know what you do with those floorboards now. I guess you come back here later. Oh, but there's a pearl. Yeah, so far my one complaint is the thing that, uh... That Nitro Rad mentioned in his video about it. That the game still doesn't quite have the musical flair that Luigi's Mansion 1 had. You know, like where Luigi sang the music. Maybe it happens a bit more later, but... Yeah, like he sang the music and he completed the song with his voice. So yeah, definitely gonna miss that if that's not much of a thing here. But I mean, if everything else is decent... Oh, Luigi's moving fast now. I'm guessing the longer you go for, the faster Luigi runs. So can I do this? Oh uh, no, I'm guessing, I'm guessing grates are a no-go for the plunger. Yeah, no go. I'm guessing you can only do very specific things. No, I didn't want to plunge, I wanted to... Yeah. That button combo is a little weird. Let's check back in here. No dark light with that. Can I plunge it? Oh, I can plunge it. Ah, there we go. There's the green one. Can't, can't get enough distance because of this thing. Can Luigi push it? Oh, he can. Yeah, that would help. That would help considerably. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Give me that. Give it to me. Plunger mechanic's pretty nice. And yeah, and now I do remember because Luigi used the plunger. And the plunger wasn't in the previous game. I mean, also wasn't in the first game, but I think that probably goes without saying. Okay. Okay, so to the elevator we go. Oh. Time is critical, Luigi. You should hurry and get the elevator tracker installed. Oh god. That, that doesn't turn that off. Yeah, time is critical, my butt. Didn't mean to do that. Meant to do that. 
Don't hiss at me. Get turned into money. Alright, EGAD, I'm here. Hello, Luigi. Seems like the installation was a success. Now then, as to what the device actually does, well, it extracts map data about the floors from the elevator. Then it takes all that data and displays it on the monitor. Isn't that great? Hey, why don't you take those elevator buttons you collected and insert them into the panel? I'm not, I'm not going to worry too hard about it because video game... Oh, okay. Well, I guess they're also ghostly. I was going to say, I'm not so worried about it because video game, but he could technically just insert any button he wanted into any slot. But the game would be over very quickly. Now you're able to view the map of a new floor. There's another surprise, Luigi. That device links with the virtual boo. The map data is automatically sent to the VB, so you can view the map anywhere, anytime. If you open the map from the VB menu, you can check out an even more detailed map. Don't go forgetting about it, okay? Let me break it down for you, Luigi. The map is super helpful for exploring new floors. While you're exploring the hotel, you should hunt down the elevator buttons. The buttons will let you reach new floors, ripe for exploration. Oh, and you might find your friends there. <laughs> One more thing before you go, Luigi. We need to do a quick test of the VB's communication system. Open the VB with plus EGAD hotline. Okay. Testing, testing. One, two, three. This is EGAD, Resident Genius. Am I coming through loud and clear? Fantastic. It appears that the VB's communication system is working perfectly. That means you can use this to contact me anytime you need to. If you feel the need to talk to me, just do exactly what you did for the test, Luigi. I may able to be I may be able to offer some advice in a tough situation. Oh, you can also check out the log using the very same system. Let me know if there if that's why you're calling, and I'll be you'll be able to see your progress. Okay, testing my inventions is fun, but we should get back to work. And speaking of work, I have a job for you. So you're able to take the elevator up to 5F now, right? I was actually staying in a room on that floor. There's a briefcase in my room. Could you fetch it for me, Luigi? My room number is... Oh, blast. What was it? And you've got a map. You'll figure it out. Good luck, Luigi. Trying to come back alive. <laughs> So we also got like lab and co-op options we can't use yet. Oh, I probably should have gone down to uh probably should have gone down and did the door thing with the plunger. Dang, I've been actually playing this a while. I'm going to guess this is a loading screen. Like a disguised loading screen. Actually, I should probably go back down to the lobby. Because there's a secret there I want to get. I love how the Dark Moon theme is uh, elevator music. Elevators scare you and you hate being in them. Then you're gonna hate this game. At least it's not elevator action. Okay, let's let's get this secret. Okay, can I open this with the plunger? Yes or no? Yeah. 
Okay, well, that didn't work. It doesn't seem like plunger is the way to go. Yeah, it doesn't seem like that's it. Maybe later. Well, okay, I'll go up to the fifth floor now. Look at this guy talking about realistic physics in a Mario game. No, I'm just kidding. But yeah, I I wouldn't I wouldn't trust the laws of physics when I'm playing Luigi. Okay, the game chugged a little bit there. So maybe maybe there has been some drop frames. Sometimes. Sometimes maybe. Ah, oh, Luigi, I just remembered something important I neglected to mention. This Poltergust GOO of yours has a new feature called the Suction Shot. Yeah, I, I figured that out. Rubber plunger, flat and smooth. Yep. Yeah, I, fig I figured it out. So they do explain it, they just give it to you before they explain it. So if you noticed you have it, I guess you could start playing with it right away. Luigi's got some serious allergies. Okay, so I'm guessing it wants me to do it over there, but what about over here? No. Okay, it's too heavy. I guess. Ooh, the money suitcase. Well, then I better do the other one. Anybody home? No. No message on this line. Well, I mean, this is like the third time Luigi has had to deal with these ghosts kidnapping his brother. He's he's pretty sick of it by now. Oh, mamma mia, I ain't got time for this this week. All the money. It might take me about three years to beat this game because I'm getting all the money. But that's just what I gotta do. Okay, what's in here? Oh, it's the haunted laundry room. I'm guessing that just goes on forever if you let it. I think I already checked this. Whoa. Oh, but I see that. One of my seven hotels. It, okay. Box madness. Oh, okay, there's something in here. 
there's a gargoyle with a jewel in its mouth. Again, not that jewel. I keep getting hurt by spiders. I think so far 100% of my damage in this game has come from spiders. You just, you just want to check. Now that there's no overheating mechanic, you just want to check everything with the dark light, probably. leave the dark light turned on the whole time. Hey, Luigi. Hey, Luigi. Uh, uh, hello. All right, 504. What do we got in here? Well, nothing once I'm done with it. Ooh. Dang it. Dust everywhere. Okay, those headphones are mine now. Guitar case. Just whatever. Whatever I can fit in the vacuum. Spider in the tub. We've all been there. Of course, we haven't. We most of us probably haven't done the thing where the spider turns into money. That's probably a Luigi exclusive endeavor. All right, toilet. Rubber duck. Okay, that's that's what the toilet had to offer. Thank you, toilet. I still hear one jangling. I hear it jangling. It's kind of hard to get when you just can't aim down there. Well, I mean, you can aim down there, but you can't see where anything is. Rats. Rats and rats and rats. Rat. Rat money. Are you going to finish that croissant? <laughs> this is a level of destruction unheard of for this series. Okay, it's not gonna let me open that. Wow. Oh, it's the claw. Oh, it's the golden rat. Oh, it's me losing health. Oh, can it be plunged? I did not even think to try. This game is introducing a lot of new mechanics. Yeah, that's it. There's just so many ways to interact with things, I can't remember them all. Okay, so yeah, while I will say that it's still not quite up to the standards of the original, I will say this game so far is a lot more atmospheric than uh, Dark Moon was. Like, I'm not gonna say it's scary or anything, but there's definitely a tense atmosphere with this one.
Oh, okay, now for the bathroom. Oh, rat. I didn't- I shouldn't have sucked it up. I needed to convert it into money. No, no, give me that money. Give me the money. Okay, there's something in the bathtub. I don't know if that's Egad's briefcase that he was talking about. But I don't actually know how to interact with that. There's, like, something up there. It looks like another plunger. Or a lever or something. Dark light, maybe? Wow. No, that's... That is, uh, the boost thing. Okay, nothing dark lighty. I don't know, I'm not- I'm not seeing anything. Or, ra or rather, everything I'm seeing seems to be uninteractable. They destroyed that. Oh, I can destroy this one, too. And that one has a jewel. Uh -huh. The riches are mine. I noticed that your username has underscores in it now. And I'm going to wager a guess that you locked yourself out of your account. Tell me if I'm right. I didn't need to see that. And Luigi backs away and he just goes, Ugh. <laughs> Oh, ghost time. It is the ghost hour, and that one... Oh, it's a ghost maid. <laughs> I love that you can beat the ghost with the other ghost. If Meverse has led me to believe anything, it's that Luigi is the hot one in this situation. Of course, if my last stream of Luigi's Mansion type Luigiery is anything to go by- Oh, there's a- There's a little golf course, there's probably a puzzle there. If my last Luigi's Mansion type stream has, is anything to go by, we all know that Velma Dinkley is actually top dog. Money in the bed. Which, coincidentally, is not a description of Velma Dinkley, so do not get the wrong idea. Oh, hey, Copperama. Probably, the stream probably won't end up being too much longer, because I've already been going, like, roughly an hour and a half. But, you know, we got a little bit still. Okay, so, can I, am I supposed to, like, push the ball into the, the hole? Do I get a prize? Like, okay, I'm pretty sure I can't just, like, yeah, if I vacuum them up, they just get vacuumed. Which, I mean, sounds pretty Captain Obvious, and cause, that's because it is. But... 
But I'm willing to bet that if you get it in the hole, there's some kind of reward in it for you. Oh, d dang it! Yeah, I don't want to do it too much. Then again, I'm also doubting my theory because this is weirdly finicky to do. Okay. Eh. No! No! Yeah, people have telling me... Pe pe people have telling me... People have been telling me that that's been happening a little bit. Oh, there we go. And you win nothing! You stole fizzy lifting drink! Good day to you, sir! Oh, I let go of the ghost. But that's okay, because I hung on to the money. Okay, and I did that because... I don't know. But I'm gonna vacuum up everything in this room anyway. You can't just put a golf ball in a golf hole in the middle of the room and not expect me to golf. That is the hand in the toilet. Dude, I don't got ca Cafe's letter. You're gonna have to just deal with that. Well, then give me back my ball. Oh, it's the rat zone. What scared him? Well, hey man, I gotta be funny sometimes. I can't just be boring all the time. Actually, it, it's probably, uh, it's probably actually Anju's letter, isn't it? I, I didn't remember the exact series of events. Oh, yes. Oh, no, 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 Get, get startled. I could not get that. I mean, I could get that, but I'm stupid. Money, but I will never forget how I lost that gold bat because I am moron. The dust isn't very subtle in this game, I'll say that much. Oh, dang, man. Oh, spider coming out of the toilet. Spider coming out of the toilet. <laughs> Not gonna lie, that was kind of hilarious looking, if also very creepy. Oh, I'm looking good. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I, I wouldn't call it subtle in any of the games, but I feel like... It was a bit less over the top in the others. <laughs> oh, yep, 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 money, 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 screwdriver. Oh, there's a gem. There's the gemstone. It's a gemstone, Luigi. Anything? Anything? No, it doesn't seem like it. Yeah. 
believe I can do that. Okay, the perp. Good perp. The perpetrator is none other than Mario. Yeah, that's very suspicious. And for good reason. Okay, well now the AC's running, so it's nice and cool in here. I wish it was like that in real life. Because I'm dying. I, I'm dying in this house forever. Don't you block your, my view of myself. Oh, no, didn't mean to plunge. Didn't mean to plunge into the depths. Ah, uh, yeah, wall money. Wish there was some meat in there, but, you know, you can't have everything you want. I will say, whether it's as good as, uh, you know, Dark Moon or Luigi's Mansion 1... I, I will say it is good to be playing a Luigi's Mansion game again. Yeah, I... I mean, that was a problem with the second one, too. Like, it just... The game had... The original had, like, electro-funk kind of thing with Luigi. You know, going like... <laughs> oh. Ooh. Oh, there's our first, quote, portrait ghost, I think. I didn't need to see that. Oh yeah, the briefcase was found, I'll say that much. Ah oh, yes, the alchemy. The alchemy potion. Give me the curtain. Oh. Yes, hello, Virtual Boy Wario Land. Hey, Luigi, sorry, I was busy and just got back to my desk. Did I miss anything important? What's the status on my briefcase? What? A ghost maid took off with it? That won't do. No, that won't do at all. Don't just stay in there. Get after her. Well, I will eat good. Yeah, Capture's being silly. Being very silly. Here, I'll, I'll restart it. We're probably go about done, but we are going to continue for at least probably a good 15 more minutes. I guess tell me if that fixed it. I don't know. It's it's all I know to try.
Oh, or did the sound desync, and that's why I had to restart it. I don't know, I kind of just accepted whatever reason there was. Nice balcony. Okay, well, I planted the plant. I didn't actually plant it, I just watered it. I can't take credit for things that I did not do. Nope, no. Man, the dark light uh, shortcut is a bit weird. Or the LNR version, whatever. Alright, what's through here? The moon. Okay, get get over here. All right, what did that do? Oh, it gave me a crystal. All right, well, cool. I mean, I wouldn't call it a shortcut because it's really more like... Yeah, I guess it's really just like press... Press both shoulder buttons at the same time. Man, what jerks. What complete fools. What loathsome fools be they. All right, come over here. I'm definitely not trying to lure you into a trap. <laughs> I had to let the ghost go, but I could beat that one into submission. Like, being able to beat the ghost with the other ghost is, is a very good mechanic. I enjoy, I enjoy that. Like the ghost coming to punch me. No, you don't! Okay, that, that was something. On the, the floor here. Alright. Can't look through there. Oh, there she is. I didn't need to see that. <laughs> Dear Lord. <laughs> But it all led up to this moment. By the way, Luigi, here's a fun bit of trivia for you. Every time you go through a door, all your progress up to that point is saved automatically. I noticed. But it might not be if you move too quickly from door to door to door to door. You get the idea. I'd say waiting 10 seconds should be enough. You know what they say, patience is a virtue. Virtue. Keep up the good work. Okay, weirdly. Uh, weirdly specific saving. I didn't see where she went. I guess maybe the room to the right. <laughs> I thought Luigi was legitimately about to say, oh my god. Oh. Oh, so you probably use the dark light to figure out where she went. Well, maybe it's like she went out of here. And she went over like this way. 
a little confusing. I'm just gonna check in here anyway. Oh, but there's a radio. I didn't see that before. Oh. <laughs> okay, Luigi can't get a haircut, unfortunately. Is it just me or is that toilet paper made of dollar bills? <laughs> money, money, money. Well, either way, I can get some more money. You're listening to KRUD. The latest in You Won't Get Away With Stealing My Briefcase hits. Yeah, I did not see where she went. <laughs> I'm guessing it's telling me she went this way. Perhaps. Yep, she's in here. I'm still curious about what this is, though. I want it. Oh my god. Oh my god, Mario. This reminds me of the time I had to chase a ghost maid. Who had eaten my briefcase. Luigi! You've been on DeviantArt again? No, Mario, this is real. This happened. I might not have paid attention to where it said she went. I mean, sometimes there's some references to be made. Season 4 Spongebob had some stuff in it that was decent, as much as we don't like to admit it. Yeah, it's not quite telling me where she went. Maybe it only will tell you if you're in the room. I don't know. Can't go that way. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm having a brain blast. Dang it, my brain has been unblasted. Oh, never mind, it's been reblasted. Okay, just everybody kind of make a single file line where I can uh, capture you. Y'all are not gonna do that, are you? Skipping is getting pretty bad. I, I'm sorry, I don't- I really have no idea what to say. Um, could try turning the frame ma maester on and off. I'm not sure what could be causing it. 
I mean, have you tried YouTube? Maybe it's a Twitch thing. I'm not sure. And let me make sure sync is turned on. Yeah, should be auto. And I'll check this. Well, okay, that didn't seem like there was an option for that. So, I don't know. I don't know what it could be, but as soon as we're catching, as soon as we catch the maid, then I'm going to be ending. So, my, my only real answer is, hopefully it's not bad enough to where it's completely intolerable. And I... And I'll be able to, like, take a look at it next time. Oh, sucking up the, the sock. Many golden spatulas will be mine tonight. It is so weird to think that there is a remake of that game of all things coming out. No, please. Uh, startle. Yes, yeah, startle the ghost. I didn't mean to hit A, but I'll make the best of it. Oh, that is very satisfying. I guess the thing we'll need to do is, once this stream is over, I could just check the YouTube archive and see if it happens there. Maybe we can get to the bottom of this. I, I definitely need to get a new capture card. Probably. Definitely probably. I'll look into it. I mean, they're not, like, prohibitively expensive, but there was money I was going to use for other stuff. Yeah, so far the only thing I'm not a huge fan of with this game is the music. Hmm, could be the computer. I mean, shouldn't be. OBS is saying I'm, I've dropped nothing. It's saying all the frames are there and accounted for. Like, usually when it's the computer's fault, it'll tell me, like, oh, you're dropping 300 frames a, a moment. All I know to tell you is I'll, I'll look into it for next time. All right, who's there? I told you not to call this number. Okay, let's find the maid, because she's clearly not down this way. No, I wanted to... Yes, use the, the dark light. Okay, what room was I in before? Was it like this one? It's gotta be this one. Yeah, okay, so she went through here. And she went into the room right up here. type of skipping isn't tracked by OBS. Well, I mean, I figure the type that's caused by my computer is, usually. Okay.
All right, let's grab this briefcase, take it back to Egid. Oh, he's so happy. <laughs> Seems that you've also acquired a new elevator button along with my briefcase. Well done, Luigi. Come back to the lab. There's a lab button. Can I just use that? You're going to make me come all the way back to the lab before I can use that, right? Just going to double check in here real quick. Oh, wait. I, I went through here. I get the, the money thing. I saw the gargoyle is what I saw. Is there, like, a hole to get to the gargoyle in this room? Oh, okay. I didn't expect there to be an encounter. Oh, he got me. He got a hit in on me. Yeah, get beat up. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, now that I've done in here something. Okay, there is a window. I'm not sure if there's any way for me to get up to the window. But there is a window. Just making sure. Nope. Oh well. Maybe you get like some elements later or something. I don't know. Oh, just one more check. Nope. Okay. Back to the lab. And then we'll end this stream there. Okay, now... No, this isn't the way to the garage, is it? Well, actually, there might be something I can do up here. Does this give me more money now? Nah. It's just... expensed. have to be mine another day, Jim. Mario. 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 Yeah. Did I already, didn't I already get this? I did. Uh -huh. Yeah, I already got this oh. one. I already got this one. 
Why you let me get it again? Welcome back, Luigi. My briefcase. Chop chop. Uh-huh. <laughs> this, this is what I wanted. Time has come to use it in battle. I'm too old to be out catching ghosts by myself. Rather than give up on my ghostly pursuits, I thought I'd create a helper to take my place. Oh, that's right. This latest invention from the brilliant mind of Professor E. Gad, I give you Gooigi. The development process was a real challenge, to say the least. Fortunately, I had a little help from someone to test the prototype. Hmm? I was just going to help? Now, now, take it easy. Here, Luigi, I'm going to attach this to the poltergeist G-O-O. -O. Turn around for me, would you? Okay, it's all set up. Luigi, let's practice a bit. Follow me outside. you in my trap, Luigi. Oh, don't worry. I'm just kidding. But I am going to need you to stay locked up. Why, you ask? Because I want you to use Gooigi to try to, to escape from your cell. You can activate Gooigi with the uh, right stick. To recall him, press the right stick twice. Ta-da! Behold, this is your very own personal assistant, Gooigi. Gooigi can slip through tight spaces like grates or vents. His body is incredibly soft and malleable. It's really quite amazing. Go on, see for yourself. There you go. He moves in basically the same ways you do, so controlling him shouldn't take much getting used to. Oh, and that reminds me. Pressing R once while Luigi's active will let you switch between him and yourself. Remember that. Hehe, <laughs> Guiji isn't even remotely waterproof, Luigi. He, if he gets wet at all, he'll melt and disappear. Be careful with him around anything wet. done, Luigi. I feel like I can let you run loose with Gooigi. Alright, we're done with your training, at least for now. Let's go back to the lab. Nice work, Luigi. Very impressive, I must say. That reminds me of something I wanted to tell you. I've been running the sensors in the lab, and they've detected the presence of a mysterious building. In fact, the ominous-looking tower is very close to this hotel. Luigi, I know you really want to find all your missing friends, but if you want a break from that, you could head over to the tower. It's probably crawling with ghosts that you can catch. Go on and test your skills there, for science. I made arrangements so that you can access the tower from the lab. Just select Scare Scraper in multiplayer. Have fun. Oh wait, I just remembered something else. You can check out Screen Park if you're feeling a little bit lonely and want to have some fun. Up to eight people can play and compete with one another. Fun. <laughs> All oh, right, you can get to a new floor now. Head to the elevator and take it to 3F. So, I just need this to save. 